Hello everyone, welcome to the ESS BizTools Business Advisory Podcast for um, this week. Today I'm joined uh, by Andrew Geddes, the uh, well-known Australian accounting industry uh, expert. Andrew was one of the joint founders of the Financial Management Research Centre at the University of New England, which um, was the trailblazer for a whole range of management accounting initiatives, not only for accountancy, but also legal and a number of other industries, which Andrew might comment on when he starts talking to us. Incidentally, Andrew, I spoke to someone yesterday who didn't really know the history of FMRC and that um, uh, whole area, and I think that's disappointing. I think accountants should understand what FMRC did for the scene today. Uh, And a lot of the things you were talking about 35, 40 years ago still haven't been properly implemented, have they? And uh, (laughs) that's one of the things obviously we're going to talk about today. So welcome, Andrew. And uh, uh, I'd like to invite you to comment on the the matters that uh, you have listed for discussion today, which starts with trends in our market. Yes, um, we're looking at changing from compliance dominance or accountants and practice to business advisory services. So what's happening out there, um, people are talking about compliance work becoming simpler and being uh, systematized with robotics, AI, digitization, etc. There's been a lot of talk about this for a long time, but um, I think it's happening. Um, hence, it's suggested that compliance production will become simpler. If the government keeps legis- changing legislation, of course, um, <laughs> there's an advisory piece around it that won't get simpler and will grow. Um, SME clients have got to be able to cope with the change in market, and I think the the major influence at the moment is uh, the inability to get experienced accountants. Um, the labour market's very tight, and they're saying we want to do interesting work, even the young ones. So. Now that's leading to a situation where a lot of smaller firms, the accountants in them are working long hours uh, and uh, I guess that leads to a couple of questions. Uh, Are you working too many hours? Are you caught in a compliance trap? Um, Are your smaller clients unwilling to pay more? 